So every single one of these tanks have arowanas inside of it. Oh my goodness, what a beautiful fish. Holy moly! I've got the arowana right in the bag. We are going to feed the fish. Oh my goodness, what the heck, man? Hey guys, what is going on? Today we're going to be getting one single new fish for the 150 gallon, five foot long tank. So let's go head to the store and get that fish. We're here now at the arowana showroom. So every single one of these tanks have arowanas inside of them. Holy moly, check out this red arowana right here. Isn't this guy just absolutely stunning? Guys, this one right here is the one that I want. He's a golden crossback arowana. What do you guys think about this little fella? He doesn't look very golden right now and that's because he's still young and he's in a white color tank. But as he grows older, his golden coloration will intensify. I say let's bring this beautiful fish back home. I'm back and I've got the arowana right in the bag here. Let's get him out of this bag and start acclimating him into his new home. Alright, so here he is. Really beautiful looking fish. So I'll just float him in right there. And take a look at that. That is just gorgeous. I'm gonna turn the lights off right now to so that he feels a bit more safe, less stressed out. What is going on guys? It is now the next day. Let's go and take a look at how our arowana is doing. Alright guys, so this is the arowana right now swimming at the top of the tank. He seems to be doing really well. Let's go ahead and switch the lights on. Just for a moment. Usually I turn the lights on in the afternoon, early afternoon, um, but it's morning right now, I'll just leave it on for just a while. But you can see how beautiful he's looking. Oh, look at that, beautiful. Really beautiful. So he was going through white tank treatment and that's um, him being put in a white tank, completely white tank. I heard that it's to intensify their golden coloration or their shining colors like that, something like that. I'm not too sure, but if you want, you can go and research up on white tank treatments. I'm not a expert on arowana, so uh, so yeah, for now he's pretty white, but soon he's gonna start getting his golden coloration. So right now he's able to swim under and in between this um, driftwood, but take a look. Swim right under. Perfect. Yeah, right now he's able to do that, but once he starts to grow big, I'm gonna have to watch out because he may um, get hurt on this. I'm not too sure. He may get hurt, he may knock into it, uh, but we'll see as time goes on. But for now, he's totally all right. Also, shout out to Baldox Tropicana. He told me to start constructing a an algae scrubber. I'm, I'm just gonna go and buy one from the store uh, because I'm not so sure how you construct an algae scrubber unless it's one of those sponge types that you attach to a stick. But I'm just gonna go and get one which I can stick on the glass and start scrubbing. And he also told me to change the 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 lights that I have right now and I agree with that because right now the lights that I have up here, uh, this is pretty, it gets pretty hot and I'm just afraid that the water, the temperature will get even hotter and it might stress the fish out so I don't want that to happen so I'm gonna have to change to an LED light um, which will keep keep it a bit cooler and not overheat so yeah we're gonna go ahead and do that but one thing Baldox Tropicana he told me not to get a arowana I wanted an arowana so I, I don't know what to do about that but uh but thank you for your suggestions and one more thing make sure you stay tuned because later we will be feeding this guy where, where is he? Oh, right there. Yeah, we will be feeding him. So make sure you stay tuned. Let's go to the fish store. Guys, we are here at the fish store. Let's go and take a look 
at the magnet cleaners, the algae scrubbers or whatever you call them. So take a look at this. This is where they keep them all. There's a bunch of different types to choose from. Look, there's even a tiny mini one right here. But we are not looking for this. We are looking for this. This is a, the largest one they have. Our tank is quite big, so I think this will be good. And let's put this down for a second. All right, let's go and look for the light. Oh, check this out, guys. These are the better here. I think the better here are really stunning. This one here is one of my favorite. Let's let them battle for just a moment. Wow, check this out. I love the coloration on this guy. The blue, the reds, and the white. Man, it kind of looks like the American flag. What do you guys think of this guy? This guy is stunning, man. All right, let's put this back. Okay, stop your battle. Okay, let's go down. This guy is also beautiful. Dumbo ear better. Look at that. Holy cow. This guy has some nice colors too. Beautiful. Alright, let's put this back. This guy is kind of like a purple color with nice white finishes. Okay, oh my goodness, look at this. This guy is orange, man. Let's take a look at this. Oh, but this guy is also beautiful. He's got a um, more... What is that? He's like an orange, red, and blue. This guy is orange. Oh my goodness, what a beautiful fish. Check this out. And you don't often get to see an orange better fish. This guy is awesome, man. This guy too, man. I like it a lot. What do you guys think of these bettas? Alright, so these are the lights right here. We're gonna be getting a light right now, but I'm not able to reach in there because there's too many lights. So we're gonna get the Beams Work LED light and we'll see you outside. Alright, so I've got the algae scrubber or the magnetic brush, whatever you want to call this. Um, the light is over there. Let's go ahead, open this thing up and start cleaning the glass. There we go. What do you guys think? I'm pretty happy with the way the tank is looking. It's crystal clear. Only problem is the corners down here have a bit of algae left on them because it's a curved glass tank. It's hard to get those corners, but if we want to get them, we can just get a sponge and wipe it down from the inside. That's completely okay. For now, I've parked the little algae scrubber right there. I'm gonna wipe the sides down later, um, but first, let's go and set up these new lights. First thing I need to do is to remove these current lights, so let me go and do that right now. So we've got the light right here, now let's go ahead and put the stand on. All good? All good. Now let's get this thing up above the tank. All right guys, are you ready to turn this light on? Because I am ready to see this for the first time. Three, two, one. Yes, that's what I always wanted, this color. What do you guys think? No, I'm just kidding with you guys. This is the night mode. Ready? That's it. Beautiful, beautiful color. It's definitely not as bright as I was expecting it to be, but I think it'll look just um, perfectly fine. It looks very natural. I love the shimmering effect that's going on. You can see right there. Beautiful shimmers. Arowana looks good. We'll take a closer look at him later. We're in the kitchen now and we are preparing some food for the arowana. This is what we have. These are just some shrimp that I got from the supermarket. They're being defrosted right now. We'll peel the shells off and then feed them to our little boy or girl. All right, guys, I've got the prawns here and we are going to feed the fish. But first, I'm going to try one of this. No, I'm just kidding, guys. No way I'm going to try this thing raw. I'm not a fish. Um, but yeah, let's go and feed this to the fish. Let me turn off the lights so you get a better look. Um, and I'm sorry for the glare. You might be able to see my tanks over there. Um, so subscribe to this channel if you want to see more fish tanks and fish and stuff like that. But let's go ahead and feed this little boy. Oh my goodness, what the heck, man? So fast.
Guys, I just remembered that I forgot to bring this Arana certificate back home. All Asian Aranas are tagged and you get a certificate, but I forgot that, so I'm gonna have to get that the next time I go to that store. But that's all I have for you today. If you enjoyed this video, make sure you give it a thumbs up. Hit that red subscribe button if you're new here. You don't wanna miss any of this stuff. And I'll see you next time.